this area right here, I'm going to build a greenhouse right here. I'm declaring right now on YouTube to all of you and myself, there's going to be the infrastructure for a greenhouse right there built within two weeks from today. I'm Jake Wyatt. I'm Wyatt. And this is the Wyatt, Wyatt. Life. The first step to building my greenhouse was cutting and removing all the sod. Finally, I helped my dad lift a sod cutting. I helped him lift a working. This was a lot of work, but with my ultimate sod kick rider, we got the job done. We're out in the morning here. Ryder is metal detecting on his own. Because before we get everything going in here, he wants to make sure there's no treasure in here. Well, I figured I'd show you guys while I'm doing it. So these are just scrap pieces of wood, just free wood that I got <clears throat> laying out back that I just cut up into little chunks. And now I'm tacking them to this thing. Tack this piece of rope down to the bottom, and then I measured out a piece of rope that is as tall as my greenhouse hoops are gonna make the greenhouse. Um, and then stretched it out all the way here and made a chalk line with Ryder's sidewalk chalk all the way, like a compass, all the way. And this is the form that will allow me to bend those pipes. It's kind of a big moment, because if this pipe bends correctly on this jig I just made, it's like the aha moment. It tells me right away that this greenhouse is gonna be built. I figured I better turn on a camera and capture this moment if it happens. <laughs> Bend is all the way to the other side, all the way. The next step was getting everything squared up and then cutting and driving all my ground posts into the ground. These would act as sleeves that the hoops would insert into. I had to make a sharp bend at the end of the hoops so they would fit correctly down into the pipe. Except for hardware, all the materials in this entire greenhouse were free. All the piping is from an old chain link fence we are removing for some of our friends. Coming together. Put the baseboard all the way around. Oh, it is the last Sunday of this challenging myself to build this greenhouse in two weeks. Like I told you on that video, the only way that this is going to get done before winter is if I set a deadline and get it done. And I did that, and you can see it's turning into a greenhouse already. I've been working on this so hard <laughs> every night. I mean, just so much into it. And you can see it's coming together. All right, enough blabber. I got to get back to it. Probably about 10 o'clock. Still Sunday. Last Sunday of the challenge. Look at all I've gotten done. I pulled my truck out in the yard and I got my headlights on. I'm trying everything in me not to just stop and like say, okay, you know, you didn't make the two weeks. So I didn't record earlier, but I really want to thank my friend Stacy. We got this whole first wall here pretty much done. I wouldn't be this far if it wasn't for him. So I really appreciate it, man. I just feel like I need to finish this tonight. I know it's going to be late and I'm going to be real tired, but I just really feel like I need to keep to that commitment, that two-week commitment. Man, it's 1.02 in the morning. The greenhouse is done. Check it out. It's got a door and everything. It is built. 
It's ready for plastic. It only took me till 1.02 in the morning. <laughs> it feels good. It feels really good. I did it. Greenhouse, two weeks. <sighs> this thing is gonna be so cool. So, yeah, I'll show it to you guys better in the morning. Well, whoo, it is cold. It's the uh, next day. Wow, it's done. There's a few modifications I'm gonna make yet, but uh, it's pretty much there. We can pretty much put plastic on. Uh, oh, I did it. Worked till one o'clock in the morning on it. But look around. Look at this, we just got this last night. How ironic is that? I finished it, and then this dumps down on us. <laughs> All the snow. It's actually, there's drifts out here that are pretty crazy. Yeah, glad we finished it. <laughs> we can wait for it to warm up a little bit. Have a warm day to put the plastic on, get some help to do that. My greenhouse, nuts. This project was extremely challenging. And there were definitely times where I doubted that I would meet my two week deadline. But there's a saying that we like to live by in our household that helped me get through that last night. Wyatt never say can't.